there's so much of confusion right now uh, and so much pressure on the CEOs, especially right. in the B2B business, on um, what to do, what not to do in terms of the digital marketing. Mm -hmm. uh, there's the RSS, there's the widgets, there's the uh, blogs, mm -hmm. uh, the wiki. And with this confusion and the hype and there's the, Twitter, uh, there's Twitter, there's a bunch of others, Facebook, right? Yeah. So, so with so much of plethora of uh, options, mm -hmm. what is the CEO supposed to think? What is the CEO supposed to do? Well, I mean, uh, there's a lot of solutions out there right now, and there's a lot of things that are cropping up. And you even had a whole wave of companies test out a presence in Second Life and and fail with that. Right. Um, the key is to is to take a portion of your budget and experiment, but, but do it in a way that's very analytics driven, where you see whether or not you're getting a good return on your investment. And there's a lot of companies that are treating these new mediums, like the old broadcast mediums. You have people going on Twitter, for example, and treating it as an advertising channel, and it's not that. You have people going on Facebook and launching banner ads, and the typical banner ad click-through rate that I've heard from a recent shop.org event is point zero zero three percent which means that it's basically abysmal performance right so there's there's a lot of there's a lot of people trying to figure out um, but in the b2b space at least um, I think an imperative at this point given that you're selling to you know clients of mid large tier etc um, is to have a blog like that's probably step number one if you don't have a blog at this point you are behind the curve uh, B2B, there's a lot of relationship selling involved with that and the personalities that made you the company that you are, your founders, your executive team, your salespeople, they should be out there on your blog communicating um, about the trends in your industry at, at, at a minimum, right? That's like a requirement for entry in social media. Um, because you have nothing to lose. You have everything to gain. You have natural search results to gain from that. You. The writing of a blog is a very liberating process where just the process of writing itself is transformational. And um, it's taught me a lot. Uh